Hi everybody, Margaret Edwards, HBBO, your home-based business owner, friend on Facebook, and I hope you are doing fabulous today. No, I didn't cut my hair, it's just very hot outside and I had to run some errands, so I put it in a ponytail, and uh, then I got under the wind. So here I am, I'm back, and I wanted to do a quick video with you today, and the reason why is because I got to thinking about something um, after a call today. It's like, or was it the other day? Anyway, how often do you write down your goals? How often do you read a good book? How often do you kind of meditate and, and motivate your own self? Um, how often do you do something that's maybe a little scary for you? Um, because the reason I say this is because do you know that the average person reads maybe five books a year? Do you know that successful CEOs, you know, people of influence and, and who are very, very successful read about 60 books a year? That's five a month, not a year. And how often do you write down your goals? There's, I know I am one to write down my goals like at the beginning of the year, but I also refer back to them often and then I kind of change them up and I'm going to change that a little bit and actually write down my goals um, at least once a day. My goal is to get to twice a day and the reason why is because I haven't quite read it yet, but I understand Grant Cardone's book, The 10X Rule is all about doing 10 times more than what the average person does to succeed. Although I did listen to his um, the audiobook, and it is amazing. And the reason why I also brought up fear is because what's on the other side of fear? It's usually your ego holding you back, keeping you safe. Whereas if you overcome your fear, you find that life isn't wasn't all that scary after all, and the things that you were kind of hesitant about um, pursuing, or you know that big leap of faith, or that first step, is is a biggie. But once you get over the fear, everything gets much better. So anyway, I'm cutting it short today because I have a webinar tonight that I'd like to invite you to. I'm on the panel. I'm one of the panelists on the Prosper uh, for All team. And so if you'd like to check in with our webinar at 6 p.m. tonight, Tuesday, May 2nd, here on, on the uh, Pacific Coast, 9 p.m. Eastern Time, I'd like you to tune in. So go to www.prospernow.com. Biz, B -I -Z. So anyway, I look forward to talking with you soon. I hope you're enjoying this video, but I hope it gives you a little food for thought as to how many books you're reading. Have you overcome your fear? Um, how often do you write down your, your goals? How often do you think about them or even just reread them? I mean, because sometimes we have to keep on track and we have to really kind of think that you know, it's easy to get off track and lose sight of our goals. But if we're adventuresome and, and we really want to pursue the dreams, uh, the lifestyle of our dreams, I know I do, then be relentless about it. Don't let anybody talk you out of it and don't let your fear stop you. Write down your goals often. Read some really good leadership goals, goals on inspiration, goals on or books, pardon me, uh, of um, interesting people, biographies, some successful people, um, books that inspire you, that give you tips and tricks on how to improve your life. So anyway, that's just what my little tip is for today, May 2nd, and I hope you join us for the webinar tonight at 6 p.m. Pacific Time, 9 p.m. Eastern, and it's www.prospernow.biz. I look forward to talking with you soon. This is Margaret Edwards, HBBO, and stay cool out there. It's going to be a hot summer. Bye-bye.